well, um, you know, it's giving the boys time to play, you know, uh, one to, to enjoy themselves. And uh, the other thing is, uh, you know, for, for learning experience, you know, having them grow up this there has been wonders, you know, especially for those young boys coming up and uh, boys that have been uh, playing in the skipper competition, you know, they haven't had this kind of exposure to give them a chance uh, to play uh, at the uh, international level. It's been, uh, this Saturday they can uh, uh, play well again against Samu. Uh, you have uh, Daniel Araku, you know, uh, the kid has been playing uh, soccer and then this is the first time he's uh, played, uh, I mean first year for him to play rugby, you know, and he's done really well from skipper to, to Warriors. That shows that uh, if you have the talent, the potential, you know, you could, uh, you could make it, uh, you know, to Warriors and even to draw the flag feature. Yeah. So the rest of the boys, the young ones have come through my uh, Motokai Mari, a 19 year old. You know, it's a uh, good playing experience for him. And we have uh, another 18 year old who's in the extended squad, Skelly Rabito. Him being here, you know, watching and learning, it's a good uh, personal development for him. Well, we looked at, we looked at our stats, you know, uh, we kick the ball a lot. If we uh, just imagine if we had a uh, ball in hand, uh, we kick the ball a lot, but we still managed to score uh, 60 points. So this time around, you know, the second game we want uh, bow ball with Tencent, keep the ball and uh, kick less, run with it more, and just on our breakdown, uh, some more uh, managed to steal some of our ball at our rack area, so it's something for us to work on, so that we can uh, uh, throw the ball around and play Fiji style rugby. You know, um, it's not what happens on the field, eh? it's off the field that's more important, because 99% is prep. If you go and uh, see uh, see the, the atmosphere in the in the team room, the group players sitting with uh, with the young ones and showing them clips of their of uh, their game with where they could improve on, or the, the clips of uh, them playing well. It's, it's important that uh, we do more of that because I think uh, learning is by watching instead of just uh, explaining. So if you go in the team room and you see the uh, experienced players helping these uh, young ones, you know, it's, uh, uh, it's, it's good. It's good for the depth of Fiji rugby and it's good for the development of these young players. Yeah, see, uh, Sibikuru Woli is one of the players who's been, uh, who is, uh, before was just like one of these boys. Coming through the ranks of the Deans, uh, I uh, had the privilege of having him in the under 20s and uh, Warriors, you know, it's a progress that he knows. The only way by, uh, for him to, to uh, mentor uh, Teitushi is by you know, helping him. And Teitushi has uh, benefited very well uh, on the experience of, uh, of seeing, just not just on the field, but especially on the field as well.